next nail we're going to do is a Christmas design but we're just going to recap on tip application but we're using a natural tip this time. So when you're sizing your tip up don't just work like that make sure you press that tip all the way down to one side and all the way to the other and as you can see that tip is actually too small. The next size up fits perfectly. So make sure that when you're measuring your tips up, you check it that way. We're just going to use a little bit of brush on glue, just along the rim of that tip. And you're going to come down at a 45 degree angle until you see the glue touch the nail and then press down. Hold it there for a few seconds before you press the wings down. Using your nails or your fingers, press those two side wings down. We're now going to cut this tip. So get your client to raise a hand up so that you can get your tip cutter underneath nice and easily. Now we're ready to dehydrate, natural nail only. And prime, natural nail only. So we're going to do a Christmassy wintry design with blues and glitters. I want you to be quite random when you're applying these products. Don't stick to a set pattern. Just place them on, move them around a little bit until you're happy. Wait for the products to set a little bit before you start padding it down with your brush. That way they won't merge together. We're now going to cap this nail in pink acrylic. Don't forget when you're doing your zone 3 to tilt your client down slightly so that the pink acrylic doesn't run back towards the cuticle area. We're going to let this nail set a little bit and then we're going to pinch. So this nail is now ready to pinch. Place your pinching tool on and leave it for a few minutes. Okay, so we've pinched this nail now, so we're ready to file.
So we're going to do a little bit of one stroke on this nail to finish it off. So you need to make sure your surface is a little bit smoother. So just use your white block to smooth it down. And then get rid of your dust. So we're going to do some one stroke holly. So you're going to dip your brush into green and yellow. Smooth it out onto your skin. And then create the spiky leaves with your brush. Then come in with your detailer brush and just define those leaves a little bit so that your spikes really stand out. Use your red to create your berries and again using your detailer brush. Your next stage is to use your white as a highlighter.
let that paint dry and then it's ready for a gel top coat. And you can pop that nail into the lamp for two minutes. So that gel is now set and we'll just finish off a little bit of cuticle oil and massage it in. That's a Christmas nail.